I'm Johnny with Balloon Animals Palm Beach and today I'm going to show you how to make a Princess Tiana in her blue dress balloon. You're going to need one blue 260. I'm using Robin's Egg Blue just so I can have a contrast in blue but whatever blue you want is fine. One brown 260 one mocha 260, one clear 260, one light blue 160, one white 160, one clear 160, one light blue 350, and one clear diamond with stars all around five inch round. So you're going to start by inflating your robin's egg blue 260. And you're going to want to inflate that till it has about an eight finger tail. Now you're going to go ahead and start with two pinch twists. So one and two. Two pinch twists, like so. Then you're going to do about a four finger bubble. Then you just bring the balloon down and make a twist right below the two pinch twists. So in this case, we're making about a six finger bubble. Then you want to make a two finger bubble. And then you want to make another six finger bubble the same size as the first one. And twist those two together. Then you make another six finger bubble. Make another two finger bubble. One more six finger bubble. And twist those two together. Then I usually tuck the tail through just to wrap it in place, get rid of the extra. Tie that off. So this is what you should have. This is her dress. Now you're going to grab your clear 260 and inflate it till it has about a 12 finger tail. And you're going to start by making a small pinch twist. Take that pinch twist and wrap it into one side of the two finger bubble, one of the two finger bubbles. Then you're going to make two two finger bubbles with the clear 260. Then just tuck this through the opposite side of the blue balloon and twist it into the other side of the other two finger bubble. Tuck it through one more time. And then you're just going to do two little one finger bubbles to span this blue two finger bubble. Tuck the clear balloon back through and twist it around so that those are locked in place there with the blue bubble. Now you're going to make a two finger bubble with the clear and another two finger bubble with the clear. And now you're going to tuck it through the opposite side of the blue dress and twist it into the opposite side of the two finger bubble that you started with. Tuck it through one last time. Make a little one finger bubble, a second one finger bubble, and twist that into the clear pinch twist that you started with. Now you can get rid of the extra, tie that off. So this is what you have. Just some clear bubbles all the way around connecting the blue that you already twisted. Next you're going to grab your five inch round. This one has a bunch of stars on it because her dress is really sparkly so this is representing the sparkles as is the clear balloon. And it's just about four fingers across and you're going to tie the balloon really close to the base of the bubble so that way you get all of it covered in stars. And then you just shove this up into the balloon you already twisted. Pull this up over, tuck it under, and just basically twist the balloon in. Now you're going to grab your Mocha 260 and 
deflate it till it has about an eight or nine finger tail. Then grab your brown 260 and inflate it till it has about an eight to 10 finger tail. And now you're gonna tie your Mocha 260 and your brown 260 together. Next, grab your clear 160 and inflate it till it has about a 10 finger tail. And then you're just gonna tie that clear 160 to the brown and mocha 260. So now they're all three attached. You're gonna start by making a pinch twist in the clear 160. You're going to make a pinch twist in the brown 260. Then you're going to make a three finger loop. And you want the clear in between the pinch twist and the brown loop. Bring the clear back up out the top. Have the mocha underneath the pinch twist and the brown underneath the three finger loop. Bring your two mocha brown balloons together and twist them in place. So you have about a three finger bubble. Bring the brown back up. Twist it around the three finger loop. And bring it back down the other side. You wanna make a bubble on this side the same size as the bubble on this side. And twist that into the mocha. Then get rid of the extra, but leave a bit of a tail. Tie that off. And then you can just pull the tail up and wrap it around that three finger loop to hold everything in place. Now you're going to go ahead and make a little one finger bubble with the clear 160 and make a small pinch twist. Make another little one finger bubble and make a slightly bigger pinch twist. And a little other little one finger bubble and a smaller pinch twist, same size as the first pinch twist. And then just make a little one finger bubble, same size as the one you started with. And then twist the clear balloon into the head. That's her tiara, now you can get rid of the extra. So that's what her tiara looks like. That's her bun, the back of her head. Now you're gonna go ahead and make a small one finger bubble for her neck. Grab her dress and twist this into the two pinch twists at the top of her dress. Now you're just gonna make a two finger bubble with the Mocha 260 and get rid of the extra. I'm gonna use this for her other arm. Tie this arm off. Now grab your Mocha 260 scrap you just created and wrap the nozzle into the two blue pinch twists at the top of her dress. So it's coming out the opposite side. Make a two finger bubble, same size as the first one, and get rid of the extra. Tie that off. Now you're ready to go ahead and do her long gloved arms. So you're gonna grab your white 160 and inflate it till it has about an 11 finger tail. You're gonna start by making two pinch twists. One. And two. Then you give it a squish and you make about a four finger bubble. Get rid of the extra. Save this for her other glove. Tie this one off. 
Get rid of any little scrap at the end. Now you're just going to take this white 160 and you're going to wrap the nozzle of the mocha into the two white pinch twists. Like so. Grab your white 160 scrap and do that for the other arm as well. That's what she looks like with her gloves on. Okay, now we're gonna do her bow because her dress has a big old bow on it. So you're gonna wanna grab your light blue 160 and inflate it just a little bit. So I've got about 20 fingers of inflated balloon here and I'm gonna make a very small bow. So I'll start with a little one finger loop. Pull the nozzle through to hold that in place. Then do a little pinch twist and another small one finger loop, same size as the first one. So you have a nice bow shape. Then you're gonna take this and wrap it around her waist, but you wanna really squish it and twist it so it's thin coming around her waist. And you can let it stick out a little bit. And wrap it into the pinch twist. Then get rid of the extra, tie that off, so that's what her bow looks like. Now you're going to grab your light blue 350, grab the end that has no opening and slide your fingers all the way down to the nozzle so that you squeeze all the air out of it and make it flat. Once you get to the end, just tie a knot. Now you have a nice flat 350 balloon. Cut that nozzle off, but leave the knot there to hold, keep the air out. And now we're just going to go ahead and twist this into the bow. You can just wrap it around the pinch twist so that it hangs out like so and looks like the other part of her bow. And that's it. She's good to go. Now you can just do the artwork. The artwork is not my strong suit, so I just do a generic princess face and I add some ringlets on the top. And it's not as pretty as Tiana actually is, but she's still really beautiful. So. If you like the video, you can click like below, or you can leave me feedback in the comments. You can subscribe to my channel. I do release videos on a regular basis. You can check me out on Facebook or go to my website, balloonanimalspalmbeach.com for more information. Thanks.